True, true. Hello and welcome to the Rad Palace. What the fuck is this? Of the Incredible Hulk for the Sega Master System. I'm Tyler Treese and I'm joined by Nathan Hambridge. How's it going, Nathan? Hulk smash. So you're a big Marvel Comics guy. Um, let's uh-huh. check out the options first. Um, what's your what's your favorite favorite thing about the Hulk? Uh, I don't really know. There's like a million of them. There's like six different Hulks. There's Red Hulk. There's there's Hulk. She there's Hulk. She Hulk. There's Red Hulk. There's Red She Hulk. And then I think there's a Grey Hulk and a Grey She Hulk. So the game has started here. I'm the Hulk. You are the Bruce Banner Hulk. Fuck off. You are the dead Hulk in a minute. Nah, this is health, I think. Maybe? I don't know. Remember, this is a Sega console, so there's like 19 buttons. There's only like two buttons on the Master System, but I don't know. I oh, guess okay. I can't touch that. I don't know. Great job, Hulk. Oh, this guy's Hulk. shooting me. So every time he shoots me... Fuck. <laughs> oh, okay, boy. there we go. Fuck. I prefer She-Hulk. Okay, that went well. That was a successful what? first run. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, it might as well just kill you when you're the Hulk. Or when you're Banner. Like you're not gonna do it. Also, anything. that's not really. If we, if we're going by comic rules, that is not what would happen. That's that was pretty cool when I picked that guy up. I don't know what would happen. What would happen? Uh, when he's Bruce Banner, he turns into the Hulk when he's angry or in danger. So when that guy shot at you, you would have turned straight back into the Hulk. Can the Hulk die? How does one kill uh, the Hulk? Rob, uh, I don't know. I mean, the he, dude went he, into space, he started his own planet. Yeah, and then he came back and fucking tried to take over Earth, so I don't know. There's the World War Hulk. Yeah, that's a fucking weird storyline. I don't think I read that one. I think I read the one right before it where uh, everybody's trying to stop the Hulk and then he gets sent to space. But I, I, never, I never found out what happens after he gets to space and stuff. He ends up on this fucking planet, and it's there's a civilization there. And Don't they, they like, like think he's a god or something? Something like that. I'm doing pretty good now. It looks, it looks really similar to them or something. It's there's some some weird happens. Do you know what I'm fighting, or are these just weird generic soldiers? And they look like just weird generic soldiers. They're not Hydra, because Hydra's always wearing like green and shit. Uh, M was yellow, so it's not M. I like when I headbutt them and they fall into pieces. That is pretty awesome. They might be robots, then I'm guessing. I like to think they're humans. And I'm just yeah, breaking think, them into pieces. Yeah. They sort of have human movements. Like, they're, they're not sort of, you know, generic robot movements. But the falling into the pieces makes me think robots. What did I even get hit with? I have a gun. You have a gun. Oh, Bruce Banner would not have a gun. Well, that went well. <laughs> as soon as you turn into Bruce Banner, you are fucked. Yeah, you can take one hit. Or you can't to even take one hit, sorry. Seems like the best like way to go about this game is to avoid conflict. Which is not the Hulk way. I thought maybe there was an inventory screen or something. This game isn't, like, terrible. It's not good. But it's... Yeah. Oh. So you know the Ultimate Marvel Universe, which is like that one where Nick Fury, Samuel L. Jackson and whatnot... 
Yeah, I, I, I mean, I'm not real in depth, but I know it's like an alternate Marvel. Yeah. Well, in that they try and do the sending Hulk into space storyline, but, but uh, well, what happens is fucking Iron Man doesn't give him enough. No, actually, they try and kill him. They they try and fire a rocket at him instead of putting him in a rocket. But Iron Man doesn't drug him enough, so he escapes. The Ultimate Marvel Universe is crazy. Did you ever read Space Punisher? No, and I'm not sure I want to. It's really good. Really be, I've never really liked Punisher. Yeah, but in this one, it's just the Punisher killing everybody in the whole universe. It's pretty great. Yep, yeah, that's like 90% of the Punisher's stuff. I also, you're gonna... Rhino right now? Who is it? That's Rhino. Oh yeah, he's in Spider-Man and stuff too, right? Yeah, he's a... He's a I thought he was a Spider-Man dude, I didn't know he was Hulk. Well, it makes sense looking at him. In the Ultimate Marvel Universe, uh, Rhino uh. is like a giant metal suit that the guy wears. God, I'm so fucked. I don't think we're going to get past Rhino. I have, a, I have a feeling I may have reached my limits. I don't know, you're doing just that for a second. Yeah, I need, to, I need to get some space so I can time it correctly. Oh, 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 oh. Go on, Banner, you stupid little man. Oh. Banner's terrible. Uh, okay, we did continue there. I think I can get him. Okay. I'm off to a bad start. I will go on Wikipedia and look up the rhino. God fucking damn it. God, no, mm. fuck you, Rhino, god damn, oh my god! Right, you ready for some facts about Rhino? First banner's fucking crawling on the ground and I'm supposed to whoop this guy's ass. Give me some facts. I need facts. Oh, here we go. Uh, Alexei Mikhailovich Stizovich. That is the real name of the Rhino. I probably said that very, very, very wrong. I thought it was spot on pronunciation. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, <gasps> I did it! Being, after being empowered, he is directed by the agents who gave him powers to kidnap Colonel John Jameson. I'll check out this rad cutscene. Jumped up. Oh. The Hulk chants for peace falls to pieces as he steps into Ty Tyrannus's trap. I don't know who that is. Woo! Who's Tyrannus? I don't know, look up Tyrannus. Okay. Because we're probably not going to see him in this video. Okay, Tyrannus. No. I think he might be this guy, the statue we're looking at here. Uh, he's immortal, so you're not gonna beat him. Well, maybe we can contain him. In the Roman Empire, Tyrannus claims to be a sorcerer, but he's actually a scientist far ahead of his time. He was exiled by Merlin to Subterranea, a network of caves and tunnels mile, miles beneath the Earth's surface, when he tries to conquer Britain. That's where you're from. It is. Uh. Wait, so is he only in like one comic? He's in this no. comic. Uh. Check it out, Bruce Banner's getting hit with like 5,000 bullets here. How is that happening? I don't know, but if I move, I'm gonna die. So I think I'm just oh. gonna stay like this. Okay. Nah, he's dead. So he's. Does he wear a cape? Uh, yes. Alright, then he's probably this guy here. He's basically a green skinned pharaoh. Okay, so imagine this guy, but green. Uh, 
Yes, lovely. All right, so that does it for the Incredible Hulk for the Sega Master System. Um, this game wasn't too bad, actually. I mean, it seems like a decent brawler platformer. Oh, he was hulking up there. That was kind of cool. Um, Nathan, what did you think of the game? Uh, I prefer She-Hulk. Oh, I'll have to wait for the She-Hulk game. But uh, Fucking Jennifer Walters. She's a lawyer. She is, yes. It's just a Phoenix Wright game, but you play as She-Hulk. <laughs> that, I would play that the hell out of that game. Same here. Defending, def defending uh, Marvel characters and, like, Matt Murdock's your rival. Fucking best game ever. Yeah, that could be fun. Um, so thank you for watching the video. Uh, subscribe to our channel. Check out radpalace.com. We have podcast videos and all that good stuff. Uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Hulk smash. Hulk smash.